I just watched a video on someone using this image right here and they were showing the halftone patterns and they did it using Linux and a script and they didn't show how the script worked and I'm not really an image expert in this area and so yeah, I don't know exactly what to do but they showed here I'll zoom into 400% and scroll up they showed how nasty the halftone patterns here are and yeah absolutely that's just nasty so I'm gonna go ahead and make a copy of this layer just easy so you could see it running or we could see the before and after real easily and I'm going to go ahead and go to my scripts and I have one called remove halftone and actually before I re before I play that I'm going to show that I could go to automate and create a droplet, just create a little droplet that I could run, and I could even script it if I wanted to. If I wanted in this in a uh, command line script, I can do that and have this little script I've just made run. But without really knowing what I'm doing, I just went ahead, I'll go ahead, make sure I click my remove halftone, and I'll tell it to play. And there it is. Pretty darn good. Now, again, I'm not an expert in working with images and so you know I'm sure someone who knew how to remove half tone better than I did would be able to do better but if we look at it really nice really nice works well it's a little getting a little bit of um, loss of the detail there that I might not want and so if I were to really spend time I'd probably work to make that a little bit better but I just did this real fast I can create a droplet could do a command line if I wanted to could even make a batch processor if I wanted to I can come in and set it to do batch just running that script. So it gives me a whole lot of flexibility.